first thing you want to do is go to the MCC home page. We're going to scroll down to the bottom of the page under resources and click on tech support. Once we are on the tech support page, click on IT resources and services. And from there we'll find faculty and staff and under faculty and staff we're going to click on VPN. If you haven't filled out a VPN request form, now will be the time to do it. This form requests access for you to use MCC VPN. Clicking on install VPN and click on the first link vpn.mclennan.edu Type in your username and password. Download the global protection agent that is compatible with your system type 32-bit, 64-bit, or Mac. To find that out, click on your Explore folder. Right-click on this PC. Click on Properties. Under Systems, across from System Type, this is, this is the number you need. So in my case, it's 64-bit. Let's exit out, out of this and download the version we need. I have already downloaded it earlier, so I'm going to go ahead and go to my download folder and double click on the Global Protection 64. -bit. Once Global Protection Setup Wizard pops up, click Next. It asks where we want the files to install at. The default is fine. Click Next. Now it's ready to, to install. Click Next. Let's close this. Click on the up arrow in the system tray and click on, on the moon looking icon. Once Welcome to Global Protection pops up, type in vpn.mclennan.edu for the port address. Click Connect. At the sign in prompt, type in your username and password and click Sign In. You are now securely connected to the VPN. If you want to double check and make sure, click on the up arrow in the system tray and the moon icon should now, like an earth icon, click on it and it should say connected. Click on your explore folder. Right click on this PC. Click on map network drive. Choose your drive letter and type in the network path, path to the drive in the folder field. If you don't know it, a better way to find out your drives if you are at, at your work computer in your Windows search bar, type in CMD. Click on the command prompt. Type in net user. Copy this down. These are your network drives you are connected to. After you type in the drive path, click finish. Enter in your username and password. Make sure you put McLennan backslash before you put in your username. Click on remember my credentials and click OK. You have now successfully connected to your network drives. Hope this was helpful for you guys. See you on the next one.